Welcome to Baller or Bust, where we test FIFA cards so you don't have to. Today we've got Fantasy Fut Alexis Sanchez. We only have him on loan because he costs 500,000 coins in the market and we do not have that. Here's the squad we're running him with. We play him in a 4 triple 2 at right cam and we play him at right striker. We tried him out in multiple positions just to see how he does. He's got 4 star, 4 star and a unique body type which is interesting. He's got high attacking work rates, medium defensive work rates, outside the foot shot, flair and finesse shot traits. He's got 92 acceleration, 95 agility, 96 balance, 92 attacking position, 94 vision, 82 strength, 85 stamina. He's got a lot of nice stats, 86 composure as well, not to mention that. You guys know I love my composure, at least people on TikTok know that. We also scored our first free kick right there if you saw it. First ball or bust free kick scored by Alexis Sanchez with the outside of the foot. If you guys remember like FIFA 18 or 17, if you played that, Alexis Sanchez had an insane outside the foot shot. Like one of the best I've ever seen in any FIFA. He doesn't have that kind of juice right now with his outside the foot shot. Maybe he'll get it if he upgrades a couple more times. I mean, he's got the potential for two to three to probably not four, but two to three upgrades realistically. And this card would be absolutely unreal because it'd probably have 99 agility, 99 balance, you know, 90 five acceleration that sort of thing but that being said to look at the card in its current state he's pretty fast he does have 92 acceleration 85 sprint speed i threw a hawk on him so i did boost his speed a little bit i like to boost his shooting a little bit as well but his finishing is solid on both feet he does have four star weak foot didn't ever see a problem with that his left foot finishing is pretty good as well in terms of his dribbling and he's good. I mean, for 500k, you would expect good. He's nothing special. He's not a, you know, Mbappe. He doesn't have Mbappe type dribbling. He doesn't have Neymar type dribbling, but he's definitely good. It's solid type dribbling. If he gets two upgrades, it's going to be, you know, at that Mbappe level dribbling probably. His passing is also pretty solid as well. You saw he just had a cross assist, I think it was. I don't know. I'm not really watching the screen. I'm, I'm looking at his stats, but, you know, he's just a solid card all around. I really can't think of a place where he struggled right here he had a sick touch and finish but he, yeah he really just didn't have anywhere he struggled in his game i mean defensively he won't do anything he's got i mean 54 defending you can't expect much so if you do play him at wide cam on get back he really won't do much defensively but besides that i mean there's just nothing wrong with this card there's a reason it's 500k and it's because it's actually unreal with two or three upgrades this could potentially actually be an end game card I'm kind of upset I can't keep him for more than 10 games, but yeah, this card is definitely a...